Hi guys, I am back today with a brand new video. Um, today I actually want to bring you guys along with me kind of to the start of my cosmetology school. Um, I don't have too many outfits, but I basically just have to wear like all black for school. So I got some outfits from Shein for that. And then I also um, do my own nails and do like my sister's nails as well. So I bought some new nail stuff, um, especially because it's Halloween. So they have a little bit of Halloween like um, jewels and charms and stuff. So I want to share that with you guys. So I'm just going to start off with showing you guys what I bought for school. I have already gone to like KJ Max, Ross, Marshalls, I think. Um, and bought a few shirts. I think I had like two black shirts um, and two leggings that I have already bought um, to wear to school because we could wear leggings, but we can't wear like jeans, like black jeans, even though it's like all black. She said pants, but like honestly, like I don't get the difference. So anyway, so I'm wearing um, leggings. So I got this first pair from Shein just so I could have more like to alternate throughout the week because I'm going five days out of the week. These are the petite leggings, um, petite medium, but I saw the reviews because I'm 5'3", five, 5'4", five, like 5'3 and a half, um, and everybody, like, my height was saying it fit them good, and then, like, kind of with my weight, so I got them in hopes that they fit, so they're just these, they have kind of, like, a V right here on the waistline, and then the pants, the bottom, they are, oh, they are, like, bell bottom. And I should have expected this, but they are honestly pretty see-through. I don't know if you guys can see me, like, in the camera. Oh, there you go. You guys can see it, like, right here. Um, I don't know. Next pair of pants. They're actually leggings. Um, uh, so same things. I can't wear anything see-through, obviously. Like, even if I could, why would I want to? Um, so I got these leggings from Shein, and they look pretty see-through as well. Like, let me show you guys. Like... I don't know if you could see it these are actually obviously thicker than the last ones um so you i don't think it's showing up on camera but they are see-through in person um it doesn't have any front line seam which i honestly just learned that i don't like front front line seams like now that i start going back to the gym i do not like them like the front seams um so yeah these are nice it doesn't have that it does have like a stretchy waistband but it does feel like compression like it has some sort of compression so when i try it on i'll let you guys know um, and then apart from that, I just liked it, Oops, not being dirty, I liked it because it has these, like, um, design on the side, so even though it's all black, it's not plain, it has, like, some design going down the pant, and then they are full length, um, also the back, it has, like, a scrunch on it, I don't know how I feel about the scrunch, I, I personally don't really have anything that has a scrunch on it, I've never been into the idea of it, I don't know, maybe it'll look good on, but... <laughs> Okay guys, and then the next thing I got was two shirts. Um, so the first shirt is just like a bodysuit because I was like, what if like I'm sitting down and my shirt goes up? I don't know. That's that's how my thought process goes. So I got one that's a bodysuit and it honestly looks like it will fit. I think I got a size medium. I don't think it shows on here. Oh, kidding. It does say tall medium. I know I just got a petite and now I'm like a tall. I don't know. I saw good reviews again on this one and I always go through the reviews and see like similar heights to me and such. Um, and people are saying it was good. So I got this one. I just personally am not a fan of this kind of material. Like I'm all about super soft materials and it's like stretchy but I don't know even like what to describe this one as. Let's see if it says. It says it's 90 by... <laughs> See, it's 91% polyester and 9% elastane. I don't know. But it's a nice shirt, don't get me wrong. Like, it's just a basic bodysuit. But the material's not the softest. It's not, like, rough by any means. But it's just not soft material like I personally prefer. But, yeah. And then, um, this shirt, guys. This is the last clothing I've gotten. It's from She and Bay, Always Turning Heads. I don't know if they have, like, a different collection. But this is the only one that comes with this tag. And surprise, this is my favorite shirt that I got. I got two shirts. But this one is just, again, like an old black tee. I can't really have any crop tops. So all my leggings are high raised. Um, so even though this one's a little bit shorter, it's not considered cropped. So that is another thing. I have a lot of clothes, but a lot of it is cropped. So that's why I had to buy more. Um, this one, it's like that active wear material. Like it's super stretchy, super breathable. It looks like it's going to be like a tight fit like 
you know what I mean? Like, not, like, like, stretchy to where it forms with your body. I think this one was actually going viral on TikTok saying it was the skim stoop. I don't have a skim shirt, so I can't really compare it, but it is super soft. It's, like, um, feels, like, cool to the touch. Like, I don't know if to explain that. But this one, it's 13% elastane and 87% polyamide. polyamide? I've never heard of that. I don't know if you guys can see it. I can't get it too focused, but yeah, I don't know. It's super soft. I think I'm gonna like this one because I have another like long sleeve from Shein, same material, and I love that shirt. It just fits me tight now. But yeah, I think I got this one. Yes, on a medium. On a in a medium. Hopefully, my criticism helps you guys choose if you guys want to get those from Shein. But onto the fun stuff. Like what I was actually the most excited about is I know I'm going to school for cosmetology where it's like hair, skin, nails, like everything. But I love nails. Like I always want to try hair so that's why I went into that. But I love nails as well. So because I do nails, I'm going to show you guys. Um, I don't do anybody's nails because obviously I'm not licensed yet. But I still like having cute material. So I got these. Um, I forget what they're called. They're like for the table. They're basically like napkins. Um, so like big napkins so it doesn't get dirty i got these i've gotten them before they come in a 20 pack so i have 40 i got them in black and this time i was like i'm gonna do everything pink so yeah these are actually really good they're really big like long um so i like it because it helps pick up like the dust easier like anything that falls on there you just like literally bundle it up and throw it away so i love those i have a mess i'm like trying to figure out where to put everything um another thing that i bought before there are these little buffers um I think these are a pack of 20 yeah 20 as well same thing they're just pink and the middle is white i've gotten these in black as well i like them these seem to be a little bit different oh no actually they're the same the same as the black ones um i do like these i just don't use these as often but i like to have them uh, for when i do need them and then guys it is halloween or it's basically coming up um so I remember last year I was trying to do like my Halloween nose and trying to find like different things to do or like decals and stuff and because I waited till last minute like I waited till October everything was either gone or it was like super late shipping like it was not gonna come till like the week of like um Halloween or like the week after and that was just something I was not willing to risk this year so that's why I actually did my order because I needed clothes and wanted to have everything ready for Halloween nose. So normally I get these professional washable disinfectable 8080 what's it called nail file. This one comes in a pack of five and this one's just the normal one, right? Like no design nothing. But because it's Halloween, I got these. They literally have like little pumpkins and things on them, skulls, and they're 110, 100 and 180 um nail files. And these come in a pack of fives and I got three. So I have a total of 20 nail files. And I don't do many people's nails, so these will last me. But I just thought these were so cute, so I had to go with the theme of Halloween nails. I do have, like, some, like, water decals that have, like, Halloween monsters, it movies, like, little things like that. Because I've had, I did buy some last year. I just didn't get everything I wanted. So this year I didn't buy any of those, like, water decals or anything. I actually bought the gems. Um, so I bought a couple. Hopefully you can see them because they're so tiny but like for example they come in packs of i want to say it's 10 yeah it looks like there's 10 in here but let me see these are like skulls that have like a little x going through it, it looks like a frog huh but these are actually skulls so i like these because if you want like a simple new one you just add this charm instantly it's halloween themed so got that one and then um those are a little bit bigger because they have like the axis going through it so i got regular skulls as well like regular skull heads and they look kind of shiny but it's just kind of like the design it has on there but these come in sets of 10 as well and then i actually got let's stay with the silver theme <laughs> silver theme and then I got another little set of 10 and there are these adorable spiders that actually have like a little gem in the middle. So I love these. These are so cute. I'm so excited to use them and I know I only got one of each but or like one order of each I guess so like 10 of each. Um, 
But like I said, I only do my nails, my sisters, sometimes my mom, and sometimes Ruby is my friend, which you guys know. So I felt like I didn't really need a lot. But I did see these little Batmans. Not Batman. These little bats. Um, let's see if I can focus. Yeah, hopefully you guys can see it. It's just like black bats on there. And like even with my nails right now, how I have them, like it's just plain black French. Like I could either throw a bat here or like flying. I don't know. And I think these would instantly make like a nail super. I also got these, um, they're black stars, but when you move them around, they do like kind of change colors. But I got these just in case I want to, again, do something for Halloween. I have like something black for it. Um, but apart from that, I also got a little bit more charms. Um, I guess you call these charms. These are like just pearls that have the flat end, so you could actually put them on the nail. And they're just different sizes so it has super duper tiny ones and then they kind of range a little bit bigger so i think these would be super cute for something like the Haley bieber nails i don't know if she has pearls but that's what it reminded me of and then i also got these it's my fault for not looking they're literally all stars like all of these are just little star charms which they're super cute don't get me wrong oh there's one heart literally out of all these stars there's one heart i don't know if you guys can see it's like somewhere up here there's like a heart somewhere here but anyways they're just stars i thought i was buying the one that had like stars moons hearts like gold but they're just stars so personally don't think i'd recommend that one i'd recommend the other one so you guys have like more options if you're doing those as well i also got a cute pink cuticle cutter and i bought this little i don't know what it's called like it's kind of like just a pen to grab the gems on like the little charms so I bought this one because I don't have one and it's a straw we'll try to put on charms if you don't have this and then this one just because I have a bunch of cuticle like pushers and stuff but I wanted like a brand new one and then I also got these nail wipes 100% lint free okay, oh, is it backwards? I don't know if it's backwards but I got these dough no wipes uh, they're just like lip free wipes so i'll show you guys i got them in pink like i said i was doing an all pink theme this time um so it's just a pink one i normally just use it's a young nails like swipe liquid or something and it has like the little the like, cap where you just like press on it and liquid comes out so i thought these would be perfect so i could just do that and then clean off the nail because i keep getting little like dust particles all over my nail polishes and it ruins the nail design so i felt like these were a need and they have a lot actually they have 180 in this tiny little box so i'm gonna recommend it even though i haven't used it i just feel like you can't really <laughs> go wrong with it and i also have been hearing that like the what's it called i think it's the uv lights that you use to dry off like or not dry off but yeah dry the gel polish i guess are harmful so i got a little glove That's how it looks I feel so weird with them but i mean if it's true i don't want to have wrinkly hands so yeah and i got these in pink as well seeing this like opal trend on tiktok you know we ball balling on a budget right now so i got this one off shein and i've honestly have never used like the chrome powders or whatever these powders are called i don't think it yeah i don't it doesn't say on here but it's pretty much like for the Haley nails like the Haley bieber nails like she does some sort of chrome so hopefully this one looks like it because my sister's been wanting that design so i'm gonna actually try it and i'll put in the description how i like it guys but i forgot i ordered this i got like have you guys seen the clear um sticky notes these are like clear pink ones they're like shiny pink ones but they're super sheer i don't know i'm excited i want to start reading just so i can use these low key but anyways lastly guys i have one more thing so i don't want to fully open them but basically got this two set of pink like sticky tape and pretty much how you use these is um say for example if i had my nails done which i do but they're old and coming off like you see how this nail's coming off it's because i went over it with the drill bit when i was doing my sister's nails so basically what this is for is so you if you have your nails done and you're doing somebody else's nails, you pretty much just wrap your nail around it with this. So anytime you hit it with like the nail fire or the 
what's it called i just said it the drill bit it doesn't actually like scrape your nail and take off your personal design um it helps prevent that so i feel like i needed this because i do plan guys like okay let me set this down but like for school like i said i start next week literally on monday and right now it is tuesday so in less than a week i start um cosmetology school I made a whole new page not on youtube youtube is gonna be mixed like my personal my cosmetology because that's all gonna blend but for instagram i did make a specific instagram i'll put it right here and i'll link it down below where it's just gonna be my cosmetology page um so i want to start doing a, more people's nails and kind of getting more experience on that um so when i graduate with my license i'm able to actually practice right now i'm just posting nails because like i said i haven't even started school so that's literally all i know how to do um so follow me on there because i'm also learning makeup i love doing my makeup but i'm pretty basic with it because i stopped doing eyeshadows so i feel like they're gonna make us do a lot more like um what's it called i don't know complicated eyeshadow looks like something more than <laughs> this um and then hair and everything so i do want to make that page solely everything beauty pretty much um, so if you guys follow that, you guys can keep up with it. But because it is going to be such a big part of my life now, like cosmetology school is, I think a lot of my videos are going to become that. Um, so yeah, so I'm basically going to the gym and going to school and that's like it. So <laughs> it's more than likely like what my videos are going to be. Um, but with that being said, if you guys have any video ideas you guys would like me to do related to anything like nails, hair, makeup, I guess, whatever. Um, let me know or if you guys want a video answering some questions about school because I know when I posted that I was getting into school Some people swept up with a few questions um, But yeah, anything like that you guys could let me know down below or you guys could message me on my social media Anything like that and I'll do my best to make a video from that because I need video ideas <laughs> But anyways, that's all I have for you guys today. I hope you guys enjoyed it and Sorry, this video was so long, but I hope you guys enjoyed my haul. Bye guys